Thank you guys so much. It was definitely fun and colorful. Now it's Market Monday with the Wolferth Farmers Market. We are talking to two other people about what they're going to have this week for their July 4th market. Plain Jane's kind of came across by accident. Uh, we had a little store on 50th and we closed it uh, right after COVID hit. So, but before we did, uh, this gentleman walked in the store and he wanted to get something for his bride, something sweet. And uh, he got some cake and then before he left, he turned around and he said, hey, you should do fried pies. And I said, hmm, I've never done fried pies in my entire life. I've done pies, cakes, cookies, cinnamon rolls, but pies. So I went home, told Bob about it, and he said, my grandma used to make apricot fried pies. Well, I don't like apricots. I love peaches, but I made him apricots. And apricot fried pies are our number one seller. And so, anyway, it came about that I tried a bunch of different uh, doughs, and I did a bunch of different fillings, and I guess about a year here later, we came, I made, I have the perfect, I mean literally the perfect fried pie. So they are golden brown and they are filled with real fruit, um, delicious. The crust is a sweet buttermilk crust. And so we decided that we wanted to come out to the Wolfers Farmer's Market and uh, we got out here and we bring 400 pies every Saturday and we sell out by noon. So we're going to have to amp up our production and see if we can't bring five or six hundred. So every, we want everybody to get a fried pie. And the ones that do, they keep coming back. And they are just very delicious. They're addicted. They're, they're addictive. They're, <laughs> they're very addictive. But we are right here in the, and we have a little building here. And we fry some. We do uh, fried cherry pies with ice cream. Uh, we def do funnel cakes. And um, there's 14 different flavors, yeah. and if you get here early enough, you can have your choice. Come out here and get a fried pie and get juiced up for the 4th of July. Buy you some fireworks, they're selling fireworks out here, and you'll be ready to go for Sunday. The IS place is family owned business. Um, of course, it started with me, myself, and my children. My family, my mother helps now, my father helps now. Um, for the most part, like I said, we're just family oriented. We love to go out there and donate. We love to be here at the farmer's market. It's just about love, putting love into the food. Because as my family, that's what we like to cook. We pretty much cook every single day. Um, I love to have gatherings. So pretty much that's what it's about, just making food, comfort food with love. Pretty much. I'm here at the market. I have a wonderful spokesperson, my sister. She's not here today. Um, but we just kind of go out there. We meet people. We greet people. And they just come over and they smell the good food. And, you know, every week we do really, really well. Every week we have a wonderful catfish. We also have shrimp every week, collard greens every week. We have macaroni every week. But since we were able to move into a bigger barn, now every week we add something to our menu. Like last week we had, well, last week, uh, the week before we had like Salisbury steaks. We had nachos, you know. Um, so every week we do try to add something a little different to kind of get our name out there a little more. This week we will be doing uh, loaded baked potatoes. So we'll have baked potatoes. Um, you can add chicken bites to it. You can add uh, fish to it. You can do shrimp to it. Um, we'll also have our good uh, famous, I call it famous, salad meat that you can add to it. And then we'll also have chicken nachos as well, along with our fish, collard greens, macaroni and cheese, and our pinto beans as well. It's made with love. That's it. You know, my kids and family are super, super honest sometimes too honest um, but it's just made from love I really I really love to cook because I, I didn't know how to cook um, and as I learned to um, my husband was deployed a lot I had to learn how to cook and I just love it I just love the cook well this did not come just for me they should come for all the wonderful vendors like I said this is my favorite day of the week if you go on Facebook I put it every week just for the you know this to support local businesses you know um, and just to meet everybody. Like I said, everyone is wonderful, helpful, it's great. And we all have, like I said, we have wonderful food, wonderful different vendors. So just to come out here and support everyone locally. Thank you guys so much. It sounds like it's going to be a lot of fun, very festive. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after the break, so stay with us.